Hello YouTube, this is Josh, making my second attempt at a video. So, many of you may already know this knife. It's actually, for the price you pay, it's actually very well built. It's a great knife, it handles awesome. This is the SOG Northwest Ranger. This is the all black version. It's a very good knife. There's few gripes I have about it. One of them is like the grooves right here. If you, can, if you can focus on that at all. It's not working. They're really sharp, so that kind of sucks. On the, the satin blade version I have of this, I've ground those like flat. Anyways, like I just said, I have a satin version of this that I've used quite a bit. But I let a friend of mine borrow that to go camping two months ago, and I still haven't got it back, so I think he likes it too. I have this one because I really enjoy all black blades, and I was just going to keep this one because it looks cool. But this sucks, for lack of a better word. I mean, it, it functions as a sheath. It's supposed to, for the most part. It holds it in there. Not the best because you can pull it out without any real strength and it shows the blade which is unsafe but the way it sits if you can see like the angle of that that's my dog crap but uh you can see the way it sits it sits like as high as i'd like but I don't know, it's not very comfortable and it pretty much just sucks so what i did was put this right here for at least a second i Got a hold of that is not going to focus at all. You probably can't make it out. JRE Industries. Heard a lot of good things about them. Bradley Mila. And I ordered a sheath for this. It took a very long time to get. I believe it was seven months. Nothing against the company, but the Dan, the man I talked to several times via email, was very quick to respond to my emails, which I appreciated quite a bit. But man alive, that was a long time to wait. I think I ordered it in May, and I received it in the mail today. It's a very long wait list. So, I'm not going to say I'd never deal with them again, but it wasn't the best first impression. Okay. So this took me, I was very patient and waited, and I'm not very patient. Okay. Came with the, this camera. This is just not going to help out. Anyways, card. And I've never done a behind the camera or anything like this. Whatever. Business card. And here we go. I got their uh, cricket sheath, I believe this one's called. And I opted for a dangler. It's very pretty. I'm trying to <laughs> look at the viewfinder and look at it outside the camera. I really wish I'd done this before so I could. I was more uh, prepared on how to set my camera up. Oh, I'm sorry, this is going to be out of focus. If I figure out how to do it better, I may do another video. Not that anybody here watched this. But uh, here we go. I'm trying to cut myself. Oh, nice. I'm going to like this a lot more. Oh yeah, definitely. And yeah, very much so. And I can wear it, what is it, like scout carry on my back. It would be left hand draw at that point, but if I had to, I could. Fire steel loop. Don't get me wrong, I love this. But, man, seven months was a long time to wait. Very nice. Now, 
I don't know if the weather's like anywhere, anywhere else, everybody else is. Let's start over. That was not cool. But right here, where I live, it's cold. We don't get snowy cold around here, but it gets cold and it rains from like here till February. It's kind of depressing. So I don't know when I'll have a chance to get, actually get any use out of this. But so far, I like it. And I have no idea how long my videos can be because, like I said, this is my second one. If you watch this, I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Leave me comments on what I can do better other than maybe figure out how to run the camera better. So it has a better focus. That probably didn't help having the garbage in the back. Anywho, it's Friday night. I hope everybody's going to have a good, relaxing Friday night. And this is the JRE Industries Cricket Sheath. Set up for right-handed carry with a dangler. It's gonna ride really low, which will be nice. I hate having things high up in my belt. All right. Oh yeah, and to open the package, I used the Cold Steel Mini, was it the Mini Tough Light, I think it is? This knife is wicked awesome for opening stuff up. I'll never EDC it, because it's too small, awkward, and it's only tip down but for opening boxes it's so comfortable and that blade it just it's killer for opening stuff up hopefully i'll uh get a better camera or figure out how to operate this one better anyways if you watch this far thank you peace